Hey, 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 y'all. What's going on? Welcome to my channel, T-Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my ch ch gemini my Geminis. What's going on, Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher? I hope everybody's doing well. I really, truly do. You know I love y'all. I hope everybody's always doing well, okay? If you're not... Sending love and healing energy always, okay? Uh, keep in mind, it's a general message. You guys know the drill already. You know what to do. New subscribers, welcome. Returning family, day ones. You know how it goes. I love you always. Keep, uh, I already said keep in mind, it's a general message. So just take what fits for you and leave the rest. Don't force it. Choir, come to the front. <clears throat> you ready? One, two, three, oh, T-Girl, T-Girl, Magic and Collective, T-Girl, 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 Magic and Collective, T-Girl, T-Girl, Magic and Collective, check us out and see what we're about, ooh, we are Gemini, 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 we sing Gemini, 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 we are Gemini, 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 Yay! That's what's up. All right, lovers, the lovers and magicians. Oh, Lord. Okay, it's already heavy energy. I don't know who this is, Gemini. It could be you, lovey. Okay, you're a part of our collective, and I just pick up on your energy out of the time. But you're sad. You're going through some type of depression, okay? You keep thinking about somebody. You wish that, or Gemini, this is somebody in your energy wishing about you, okay? Take it however, what side you go. But whoever this is, they, they feel like they missed an opportunity with you. And I think it's because their finances are kind of running low right now. So they're kind of like looking at you in this type of star quality energy. They're spying on you. And yeah, they're looking at you as wish. They see you being uh, self-sufficient. They see you being, you know, some type of boss or entrepreneur. They see you as being the Ten of Cups, the ultimate wish fulfillment. And they see you in the Ten of Cups. Like you're unbothered, you're happy, you're fruitful, you're tapped in. They see you have this pure energy essence about you. For some of y'all, it's the same sex. For some of y'all, it's not. But for some of y'all, they are on the down low. I just got to keep it 100. And this is what's heavily burdened to them. Because do they know that you know? Or they wonder, do you know? of their sneaky deception of how they are into the same sex or they just have a lot of love for you whoever this person is but i am getting though that they are having a heavy burden they're struggling with their sexuality for some of y'all not all of y'all and then others of you they just have a lot of love for you and they're struggling okay i don't but no they're struggling about something and it's something intuitive okay Possible. Ooh, for some of y'all, why this Queen of Pentacles keep coming up? But you are in this Queen of Pentacles as well, Gemini. You are. But there's something going on. I don't know. That's how I'm feeling. And that's what caused this person to walk away from you. And they know that they're not going to get a new beginning with you. That's why they're sitting in that sad ass, like wondering, what was me, wishing on a star, hoping that they get another chance with you because they see you as the Ten of Cups wish fulfillment. Okay, I got getting a couple of things going on. For some of you, not all of you, this person is in the same sex and they were cheating on you. It's just too much going on over here. This person's a whole bunch of shit going on, okay? And they, look, and you're not talking to them. You're not communicating with them and they're just wishing and hoping and praying that they can talk to you. They don't feel like you're going to talk to them. The eight of wands in reverse. There's no communication, okay? They want to talk to you, but... It's just wishful thinking. They're trying to figure out what they're going to say, how they're going to say it, because you already know why they walked away from you. You already know they were keeping you in third party energies, even though the three is not up here, probably yet. This person is trying to figure out how they're going to come and make an offer to you and love bomb you, or you're trying to figure this out, Gemini. Okay, but you're still flighty and non-committal in your ways. You're still a liar. Okay. You're trying to figure it out. You're in your emotions and your heart. Okay, over this person, 
Because, but, but you already know about this third party energy that you, you, you violated whatever, whatever, whatever. Okay. Be this emperor. That's what it was. Wanted to have control. Who is this? Um, who is this queen of pentacles spirit? She keep coming out in our readings a lot with this queen, this king of swords. That's why this person's heavily burdened. They walked away to go be with the queen of pentacles energy. And now this person want to come back to you and they can't even get it up no more with this Ace of Wands in reverse. But you already know. You already know. And they going to have the nerves to put you in competition. You already know why they got you in competition. Or who, who is this Queen of Pentacles though? The Queen of Pentacles is the person that they had you in competition with. That's what I had asked. I was like, what? So Spirit, what competition? Yeah, this third party energy. Because at that time, they thought that person was their two of cups. But now they're bored over there. Maybe because they got, I don't know. Did they get them pregnant or did they move too quick? Or now, yeah, they feel backstabbed and betrayed. Child and I spying on you. Child, they possibly married the person and now they want to come back to you. This is so weird, but they are hiding some type of secret though. Yeah, they are hiding some type of secret. They're praying. Like I said, this person's praying for you or you're praying for somebody. You see them as wish fulfillment. This person's praying to God. Yeah, you're there. There's their two other uh, two of cups. Just the two of us to do to do. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us, you and I. <laughs> and they said, mm, I want to come back. <laughs> I want to come back. I should have made. Yeah, that's exactly what had happened. So what had happened over there with this Queen of uh, Pentacles energy? What happened over there, spirit? Because this person got bamboozled for shizzle grizzle. Because they thought they was really going to leave you for this Queen of Pentacles energy. Child, that shit didn't go nowhere. They got juggled. She got, was already married. The Queen of Pentacles was already in a marriage or a relationship. They got juggled. That's what happened over there in the Queen of Pentacles energy. So they thought they was going, honey. That shit it was like, skirt, skirt. But now they're mad and angry, though. This person's pissed off because, like I said, that's why the Four of Cups is here. They're bored. They missed the opportunity. All for a one-night stand. Possibly a younger fire sign. Doesn't have to be. But, Gemini, here you are. This I'm picking up this is a Gemini. And they are all imprisoned in their head praying with the, with the star card that Gemini come back. Because they possibly are in the cold. Or they are lacking or something. They need a house. They sad. Yeah, they going through some type of poverty. They're in regret of whatever they did, this four of cups, because you have stability. So whatever they went to, they thought they were going to get stability, but this person was already juggling them in a third party energy. Yeah, she had them in competition already. Oh, Lord have mercy. So spirit, and then they have the nurse to be spying on you, Gemini. Could be a Libra Aquarius or Gemini, but I have Justice up here with the Sagittarius energy. They could be any of those signs. But yeah, somebody sees your glory. They see your independence. They see you're happy right now. They're seeing you're getting your wishes fulfilled. Now they're looking up at you. They possibly could be looking up at you at a platform. You could be some type of healer. Very loving and balanced, okay? People look up to you as you look up to the divine. You're tapped in. You're connected. You're very wise. You're very clear in your communication. You're very, you're the king, queen of, I'm getting in for synergy already. Okay. We have the queen of cups, the, the queen of swords and the queen of pentacles up here. So this is empress already. Okay. This person tried to put you in some type of competition. I get jealousy. So I don't know who was jealous or what was jealous. I know it wasn't you, but somebody was jealous of your, and because maybe you were tapped in, maybe this person's intuitive too. Okay, but you're into you're tapped in like you're connected like everybody's connected because see how he, this person's tapped in, you know, their heart space got a little glow to it and stuff and he got his eyes closed meditating. But look how you're connected. You're tapped into the ethers. Okay. Yeah, this person's wishful thinking now they're they're hoping that they can come and, and celebrate and come together with you again. But what well, uh -uh. how does Gemini feel about this energy spirit? Gemini, you feel like they're the motherfucking devil. Hell no. 
you feel like they have obsessions. They have a, a lot of, they're low vibrational, very toxic. They possibly was trying to do black magic on you to keep you trapped and imprisoned in your head because they're like, you're my two of cups and you're not going nowhere while they go off over here somewhere in the corner and having, you know, their three of cups energy cheating on you, putting you in third party energies. They want to keep you bound and trapped to them. Okay, yeah, because Gemini, this is you, or this is you doing this to somebody else mm, to keep them stuck. But your ass is the one who's stuck right now. Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher is in this energy. They're free. They're tapped in, just like I said. Tapped in, and they get brand new beginnings. Okay, they have good news. Gemini, some of you guys got great news coming to you, okay, from a King of Cups energy, possibly. And this is a new energy, though, that just popped in. So this King of Cups is a new energy, okay? Um, What else? But you do have this old energy, honey, trying to come. Child, they childish as hell. They really are. But they want to, ooh, they're all in the, look, Gemini can't make it up. I got to get to you. Jesus, please bring them back. Bring Rebecca, bring Betty back so I can marry him. I have structure and discipline. But Gemini, you already know this motherfucker is us. Look, it's, it's over. They want a rebirth. It's over. They're not going within and using their intuition. They're still trying to figure out a way how they're going to come back because they see you as so fruitful, so abundant, so brilliant, so vibrant, so light, so free, so lovely. Look at you. They see you as wish fulfillment. But they didn't see you as wish fulfillment when they was over here creeping around with a... Uh, yeah, look at him. Look, they was over here creeping around. I was going to say with trash. And if the Queen of Pentacles is not trash, it just happens to be an earth sign. Maybe this person's very materialistic, money hungry. Now, the Queen of Pentacles in the upright is not that. But this Queen of Pentacles is hot in the pants mm, and put you in competition. So I'm getting you already know. They are part of, I don't know, you know them somehow, some way. Maybe you've worked with them before. Co-worker, friend circle, family circle, karmic energy for sure. They were competing against you. It was somebody that they left you for that was competing against you. Possibly lying on you with the seven of swords energy over here. Yeah. Making up things and saying things. Full, yeah, makes, causing illusions and confusions to get your person to get to take a leap of faith with this person. Because your person wanted to taste, they wanted to taste what your person had going on. But honey, I don't know, maybe your person was burning already or maybe they burnt your person. And they took a leap of faith and said, oh my God, and got stuck. So honey, with a, either a baby or they realized that they were burning. Take your choice, Okay. But it was a tower, however it was, because, honey, this person's immature. Maybe they did it for money. Mm. And they held back from the empress, which was you. And you were the motherfucking ace of pentacles. So somebody did something for some money. So I don't know if this queen of pentacles, child, what was going on? Who offered what for money? I need to know. So you might have a friend prostitute, child, that be offering shit, her coochie. Somebody offered somebody because they didn't have no money. This child is full in the reverse. So whoever was having financial problems and difficulties and maybe your person had money, the Queen of Pentacles, she do got money. She was always craving your person. Wish fulfillment, okay? Um, Your person was in a financial situation because they was a hobosexual anyway over here. Wishful thinking, oh, I can get away with it. I can get away with it because they was doing stuff with other people in the dark anyway. So, yeah, this person worked hard for the money. Um, So, this Queen of Pentacles took a leap of faith and offered this person a little something, something, something for the can. Okay? So, that for some of y'all, uh, that's how it went. And then for some of y'all, they just, I cannot. Okay? They thought they were going to get the Ace of Pentacles. So, even the Ace could have been a relationship. Maybe they thought they were going to be single, independent when they got with this Capricorn energy and they were going to move forward and have stability in their life and love with the Queen of Cups energy but honey as soon as they got over there it was a board or a missed opportunity because the Queen of Pentacles was juggling they asked because she was already in another relationship maybe she realized that the person can't even get it up no more maybe they just didn't get a new beginning and now they're defensive and shit because they want to come towards you but that shit is flat okay this emperor 
older person was playing all these fucking games. It is somebody from your past and now they have nostalgic memories or feelings about you because they're stuck like Chuck because they done gave away their wish fulfillment for a night of passion and they ended up getting trapped. Okay, so somebody made somebody a Capricorn was manipulative. Okay, so it got to be a Capricorn in Gemini somewhere. Okay, low vibrational toxic. So somebody gave up their wish fulfillment and got trapped somewhere. This emperor did. Yeah, now he feeling some kind of way because now you guarded and defensive against anything. Who Gemini. Wow. Yeah. I feel like you freed yourself. And now you're sitting in this Queen of Pentacles energy, High Priestess, wish fulfillment, tapped in. You're never going back. You released that heavy burden. And now you're in a wonderful space in the Ten of Cups, wish fulfillment. You're just waiting. You're just waiting on another cycle to be balanced out as far as you moving forward. Okay, this person's spying on you. They feel backstabbed and betrayed as they backstabbed and betrayed you. But this is justice, though. That you're able to balance out your life and get equal give and take. You could be having your own platform. You have a new business that you just started. You're protected and guarded over that right now. Excuse me, but you will be celebrated, though. Just keep moving. Keep going. Some of you don't know where you're going and how you're manifesting or how you're building, but don't worry. It's going to be the Ten of Pentacles, okay? But some people, I mean, some people, whoever this energy is that backstabbed and betrayed you, the one that wants to have a relationship and marry you, the one that cheated on you and went with somebody that was, that was married, that person wants to have a reconciliation with you, but the, only because you're the Empress energy. So now they're all in their head how they're going to offer this love to you. Or because you are the Ace of Cups. How, what's going on? Yeah, you're the Empress. You've elevated so high. They are in a bad situation, you guys. Whatever they've invested in, it did, like I said, it didn't pan out. They they didn't get the Ace. They got the Six of Pentacles or they got the Page of Pentacles or they got, not, they didn't get what they thought they was going to get, but a backstab and betrayal. And now they see you're investing and you're protecting your investments. You're protecting whatever you're growing or whatever is going on. And they want to reconcile. And you're like, mm -mm, I don't want to reconcile with you. Look, 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 Gemini, you skirt, skirt, hermit mode. And they, because you know this person, you know the energy that they carry and what they bring with them. They bring toxicity. It doesn't matter. They are a karmic energy. This karmic emperor brings toxicity. And on top of that, you're an earth angel. You're an empress that deserves the best. You don't deserve, or man. Emperor, Emperor, Empress right here. This was your karmic devil, devilistic energy that you're in hermit mode from. Okay? Because you already know what they did to you behind closed doors. They had this love affair and invested in something else. Possibly another family. Okay? Oh, wow. But now they're under judgment. Okay? And you already like, no. I forgot what I was going to say, but it was, but anyway, spirit, bring it back. But you're guarded right now. Okay, you don't want to invest in this person. This person is under judgment and they are, they're stressed out because they didn't. This person is really stressed out because, like I said, they were trying to cheat on you with the Queen of Pentacles because they was going to get the Ace of Pentacles. They got the Page of Pentacles and now they're stressed out in the Nine of Swords under judgment because you're guarded and defensive and they know that you're their Two of Cups energy. They want to invest, but you're like, hell no, I don't want to invest in you. I'm standing in my own motherfucking power, okay? Okay. And so they wanted to marry you now, or they wanted a relationship. If they'd known it, now they know that if they would have moved forward with you in a relationship or structure and discipline and had true, real love, they would have been the king of wands, king of pentacles. They would have been this emperor and their path would have been different. But they held on to a secret, but it was a fated event. And see, that's what, honey, let me just tell you. I don't know what they thought they was going to get over, but they got back to and trade on. Now they got to sit and stare at you. Get justice. And temperance angel. Yeah, so you could have to be on a spiritual path, spiritual walk where you teach the world. This person has been stopped in their tracks. They feel backstabbed and betrayed now because you're not even who you used to be. You're spiritual. You're tapped in. Like I said earlier, you have a life. You're in your life purpose now. This person missed out on their life purpose. They're supposed to learn a cycle of balance and closing out cycles and stop lying and hiding secrets and shit. That's what got their ass in this three of um, wands right here. Is it the two? No, it's a three. It's the wait, the waiting game. 
And now you're guarded and blocked and defensive. So now it's a missed opportunity with this Four of Cups energy. And now you're moving on with your life. Period. And this is bringing a tower to this person. But there lies in deception for this one night stand. I mean, was it really worth it, Spirit? Did they? I mean, I have to ask Spirit, was it worth it though? Spirit said, hell no. It wasn't worth it. That shit ended over there. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Yeah. Okay, so let's see what else. Hold on. Let me get these together and see what else Spirit might have to say about the energy. Yeah, look at them. They're in so much regret that they took a leap of faith with this Queen of Pentacles energy. And the Queen of Pentacles is already married in a relationship, honey. And honey, uh, and something, I don't know what this ace, of, well, I want to know what that is. I need to know what that is, and then I want to know what that is. With, oh, yeah, she was already married. That clarified that. But, um, and now they feel like how they're going to try to manipulate you back into a situation of a one-night stand or something like that. But they got, no, nah, they done ran out of luck, honey. Okay, they, they done ran out. So, Spirit, what's the say of wands in the reverse? No new beginning. Okay, the backstabbing betrayal, the ace of wands in reverse, honey. They can't get it up no more. That's how they backstabbed and betrayed you. So that's probably one of the, and maybe that's, I don't know. What is the, they thought they was going to get a new beginning. She was already in the ace of pentacles energy. It was just wishful thinking when they got with this queen of pentacles energy. It was a YOLO, YOLO, okay? Mm-hmm. So it didn't work out. She was already married in a relationship and possibly one of somebody you know in a friend circle, co-worker, whatever the case may be, that has you in some type of competition. Now, what's the star? Because they on their hands and knees begging, begging you back. But Teresa, you holding yourself back. you like, hell no, because I know everything. And you don't even have to be there to know. Yeah, that's their judgment, though. You already know they heavily burdened about something. You don't need to need to be there. You're, you're a high priestess. You're tapped in like I said. Yeah. You'd just rather be single and abundant. That's where you'd rather be in this person. Yeah. because And they're heartbroken because you know about this motherfucking queen of pentacles energy. I cannot make it up. And that's why you guarded and defensive. Because they put you in a third party situation over with this queen of pentacles energy over money. Or whatever the case may be. You know this. That's probably why they blocked you. This person doesn't want to take accountability and responsibility for whatever they do and how they move. Because I did see the page of swords and I mean, the knight of swords in the reverse. Okay. But you know. And so, no, you're blocking and you're guarded from them. You're going within. You don't need, like I said, you're too tapped in. They want to know how you know because you know you're the high priestess. Duh. God tells you everything. They're not tapped in like you're tapped in. I heard this person lost their intuition because how they didn't, they would have moved. From, look, Knight of Swords in reverse. And now they're going to trap themselves in a, situ a sticky situation. Well, I mean, at the end of the day, so how does Gemini feel about this energy spirit? How does Gemini feel about this raggedy energy? Jennifer, now you feel like, uh-uh. Yes, Gemini, you like, uh-uh. Gemini, you're too temperance. You're too tapped in. It's like, No. They're slow, number one. You don't feel like they have any worth. Okay, they can't help you build. You feel like just it's over. It's a death. It's oh, You've accepted it, and you're fine with that. That's why you're the high priestess, and that's why you have high ranking right now in this hierophant energy. That's why you get this brand new beginning, definitely. And that's why you get balance, because you done close out the cycle with this person, and you receive the Ten of Pentacles. You receive other another soul tribe, another family. Okay, another business idea. It's just a missed opportunity from this person because their lust and their greed took over. Yeah, they don't have balance. See how that flip like that? Now, I think these cards be flipping on the table and I'll be like, what? Look, the cycle's been complete. You're tapped in. You see how tapped in you are? You're tapped in and you're protected. Okay, you're having some type of elevation every day, every day, always. I don't think this person's going to be able to keep up because you're so protected and you're so elevated. You're so focused. Your chakras are all aligned and balanced out. It's just a missed opportunity because this person is just too imbalanced to be with you. You are an empress, emperor. That's who you are. You deserve stability, foundation. You deserve justice and peace. Okay, 
And this person, all their karma is, is to watch you be sex successful, successful, <laughs> successful, independent, abundant, start your own business, watch you from afar. This person is watching you from afar. Maybe some of them support your business unknown to you, but you don't give a damn. <laughs> You're focused. You're focused. Okay, you done walked away and you don't give a fuck. And you feel that this person is a liar as well and they're very immature and they don't have, like, it's just a, too much of a burden. You feel like it's another child that you have to take care of, no matter how old they are. But I am getting, they are the Emperor, King of Wands energy. Okay, it could be a fire sign. This is an older gentleman. They look good. They go off of their look to think that they can get what they want. But you're so high and tapped in, you're, it's like the passion is gone. There's no more no. You don't even get hot for this person anymore. I hear low-key because my stomach is bubbling up a little bit that it kind of repulses you a little bit. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because this, this is how this this is how you look at this person. And I said in the two of pentacles, you don't feel like they're balanced enough. Yeah, you don't feel that way. And you feel like they're petty. Like they they they, they want to win at all costs. Like it doesn't matter. And they're emo and you feel like they're a little bit of gay. I mean, they then they're not telling you the truth. Child, that's just how you feel, Gemini. So I'm gonna end your reading right there. What is this, Holy Spirit? I got to see this. Yeah. They're too confrontational for you. I can see if they were loving and kind and, you know, helping. But this is all, it's too much conflict. The five of wands is going on and they want to spy. And then they got, they are regretting with the lies that they done told. And they're, it, this is too low vibrational for you to even be with. So spirit is just telling you to keep following your intuition. Keep listening to your guides and, keep, and take a leap of faith into something else. That's where you're at right there. This is why you're happy. Okay, baby. So I'm in your reading right there. Lord have mercy. But this person, mm, oh, well, I mean, I don't know what to say at this point. It's just over. And God said that for their punishment as well, just FYI, not like you care. But this is out of commission for life, for the rest of their life. Okay? Yeah. It's over. It's over. Okay? All right, Gemini, that's been your reading. I love you so, 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 so much. And I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.